Now, Central Oregon's local alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Bob Shaw. Good Thursday morning, 19 minutes before the hour on a morning that is quite chilly. Uh, we've had this broken cloud cover move through central Oregon. We're kind of on the back side of storm activity that has pushed off to the east. Consequently, uh, we will see the sun today, but probably not totally cloud free. 30 degrees right now at the Bend Airport. That's one of the warmer spots this morning. What uh, wind we had calmed and now is picked up out of the southwest at six miles per hour. It has been calm as well at the Redmond Airport. They are reporting 28 degrees out there. So chilly morning here. In fact, uh, so much so you may have a little frost on the windshield. Give yourself a little extra time to contend with all of that. We have a lot of clouds moisture being pushed into the west coast. Storm activity for us has moved off to the east a little bit uh, through the Idaho border. We are looking at this variable cloud cover right now and this is pretty much what we're going to be dealing with here for the next couple of days. May bring a spotty a sprinkle or two to the eastern portion of our state but overall we're going to stay pretty dry. We don't get a lot of wind today either. We'll see these light and variable breezes take on a little more of a northerly flow and stay very, very gentle. In fact, light and variable will be uh, pretty much the wind order for the day. And going into this evening, watch those winds calm and stay pretty calm overnight. Morning thermometers, well, it's frosty here. Just about all of us are below freezing. Warm Springs has been locked in at 35, and the rest of us are at the uh, mid to upper 20s with a couple of spots at 30 degrees. We are going to stay chilly today. Yesterday, we hit the mid to upper 50s. That's pretty much where we're headed today. We'll have a few spots that'll hit that 60 degree mark, but just barely so. Cold again tonight, they look a lot tonight like last night here. In fact, this pattern is going to stay with us for the next few days. We'll be in the mid to upper 50s, low 60s. Uh, we'll see overnight lows getting down to and below freezing for many. Uh, we'll stay fairly dry until we hit about Sunday and then the clouds build in. We have about a 40% chance of seeing some scattered showers and with overnight lows Sunday night getting down to freezing and and below, don't be surprised if Monday morning with those uh, rain showers, you wake up to a little bit of snow on the ground as well. Uh, there'll be more cold air that will push in on Monday. We'll struggle to even hit 50 degrees on Monday and uh, overnight lows will be down in the 20s once again. Well, we dry out fairly quickly. Uh, we will go into the middle of next week with low to mid 50s for daytime highs. Overnight lows will be scattered through the 20s once again.